want you alone. Okay. Well, if that wasn't creepy, you know. Okay. Oh, we're all the way back here. Okay. Well, these guys are friendly. Uh, let's catch the elevator up. Those are like pods or something of those big guys. It goes up one more. Oh, it just doesn't go all the way, so I can't ride it. Gotcha. Going up. Oh man, this is a uh, this is a fun game, I guess. Yeah, man, I can't wait to like I don't know finish it just because it's like oh it's not like it's a bad game in tires. I just like you know what's next? Jeez. Okay, so so it wasn't me last time. Where's that guy? Where's the baby? Where is he? There he is. Awesome. So we're in Zen. I guess that's what they're calling it. Like, it's been mentioned a few times, but it hasn't been mentioned. It's like, you're gonna go to the Homeworld Zen. It's like, uh oh okay like they don't explain where it is what it is what we're doing like like for all i know we're like recruiting for the boy scouts or something you know oh there's two of you oh man well no nah, shoot come on So I will like, how do I say? I want you alone, yeah, yeah. I think it's like leave me alone is actually what it's saying, right? Hi little buddy. Bye little buddy. I'm gonna call that one Greg. The one on the elevator is always Greg now. Um, but like prior to this, I've actually watched like uh, Freeman's Mind. But like never in one complete like go. So like I know what happens, but I don't know it, if that makes sense. Like, I know the rough outlines of, of this game. But, you know, I've never, you know, s played or seen the entire game. And I'm dead again, aren't I? Okay. So, like, I knew you could go to Zen. Like, I knew where Zen was. But I didn't know, like, how you got to this moment, if that makes sense. I didn't know, like, which way it's, like, you're going through. Because I know you ended up in the office. Went to the chamber. From the chamber, you messed around, I think, climbing elevator. Like, this was all, like, what I thought it was. It was, like, climb the elevator shafts, get back to the office. The office is destroyed. Find out what, like, what's somewhat happening. And then, like, uh, then, like, what is it? Like, you go outside, you come back inside. Then you fight the assassins or whatnot for, like, the first time. Then, like, you go outside again. Or, like, you go to the cliff face, rush back inside, do another section inside go outside for like the last time technically and fight those big monsters like the whole uh, sniper alleys and all that like in the warehouse like I thought that was the last section outside and then like after that you find lambda squad but I didn't know how you found lambda squad like that entire chunk was like gone for me like I seriously wouldn't know <laughs> and then like I knew you went to Zen but I didn't know how many like how far you were where I was in Zen like I think I'm about halfway but, you know, like, I cannot confirm that, like, the slightest. Like, I, I, like, I knew about this part, but I didn't know about the whole, like, uh, what is it, the three-headed thing where you throw grenades and all, like, I never knew about that. Um, what else didn't I know about? Like, I didn't know a lot, to be honest. Like, I knew enough to get by... But, like, I've never really, I've never played this game. I've never really, you know, sat down and played it. Actually, I've never played it, to be honest. That's actually, like, the one thing that's true is I've never actually played Half-Life. Which is why I kind of wanted to play it and, like, record my reaction. Because, uh, 
I don't know, I feel like it would be interesting. Like, it's just something, like, there's just some games where people are like, oh my gosh, it's so amazing. It's like, okay, well, I gotta, you know, play it and, like, give my thoughts while playing it. Like, I think I'm gonna do that with Mass Effect. I've never played Mass Effect. I've only seen bits and pieces of the first three. Like, I can't even tell you the storyline. Like, the best thing I know is, like, these big things called the Reapers come. And, like, they just destroy everything. But, like, I don't really know why. I don't know what they... Like, I really don't know much about it. I know you're Shepard. Um, I've played, like, the maybe the first 30 minutes. Like, I got to the first time you're on the ship or whatever. And then I stopped and I was like, mm, I'll just wait. Because I want to play all three. And, like, carry the character over and keep a storyline going. But, like, yeah, that's... Like, on Twitch, uh, like... I'll update, like, the whole Twitch thing as we go. So, like, as soon as I finish this, I'll, you know, I've been uploading as we go. So I'll upload it. I'll put, like, done. And then, like, next to that, I'll put, like, a hyperlink of the, uh, the entire thing. Which will be nice, you know. Be nice to see, like, how this all goes, how it comes together. Don't break it, don't break it. Okay gonna say this is where we died last time like and I'm playing these most of these like data back to back data to oh shoot someone screwed up and his name was Freeman yeah but like I'd also like to you know play through some MMOs uh, on here, just like chillax and play something else. I know a lot of my friends play PUBG. I don't think I have the network right now to play PUBG, sadly. Hashtag, uh, gotta hate Cox. Um. But, uh, yeah, I'm trying to like record stuff that aren't too taxing on my PC because it seems like right now a lot of like my, my upload and download, like when it comes to streaming, is all based on what game I am, what a game my computer can handle, because it's like, oh, I can stream PUBG, but it's like, you know, 10 frames a second, but I can stream this, and it's like, pure 60, actually 50, 60, I don't know, I have it up, yeah, I don't think you can see that, I have the interface on here to where I can see my FPS, I capped it at 60, um, I don't think there's much use for going any higher, I guess, that I can assume and figure out, okay, can those guys, like, okay, that's fine. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Save again. Like, that's the one thing I do have to say I like about a lot of these games, is, like, you end up saving a crap ton. And it's, like, it's, it's great, because it feels like, you know, you, you, you get an inch with some of these games, and they will take the mile faster than, like, you know, it's like, Oh, we're gonna give you health. Awesome. The next one was like 12 enemies. And you're like, well, better save. You can die. It's, I don't know, it's, it's a nice change from everything to being like, oh, this mission's too easy or this mission's too hard. It's like, it's a great change for like what it is entirely. Uh, I gotta destroy that. Awesome. I have no ammo. Great. Nope, I'm gonna step back. We're gonna save, obviously. I don't know, that's just, that's like one thing. I also like the dynamic uh, aim, like, you know. Well, wow. Like the whole, like, it's, th there's no need to entirely aim. It's point in a direction. Like, it's a, it's a nice chain from like what I'm used to you know like yeah I can just point it in a cer certain direction it'll fire but it's like you know if it needs help with those little things like some of the guns will auto adjust for it which is nice you know and it's nice that there's like shit accuracy on everything you know it's, it's a nice change you know it really makes it feel intense in my eyes because it's like you're not a perfect soldier you're not gonna be a hundred percent accurate you're gonna miss a lot of shots and it's like, it just, I don't know, it pumps up that action to me. Like, it's like, oh, you hit two, you're like, yeah, I hit him, and then you miss, like, ten others, and you're like, oh, shoot. Like, I don't know. 
I think I'll sh I think I will actually stream tonight because I think today is my last day of like work and finals before I have before the year. So that sounds nice. I don't. I can't. You know this. I don't know. There's just so much I have to like to say about this game. Like it's so amazing in my eyes. Like I'd love to play Black Mesa through. Um, just to see the changes. Like. Like, I understand now why, like, everyone loves this game. Oh, jeez, jeez, jeez. Because it's just, it's, it's unique as hell. Like, and without even playing through, like, the second one, you know, I, I have to say, like, I really kind of want to have Half-Life 3. Just because it feels like, you know, let me get him. There we go. feels like in this first, like, just in this first game, I'm given so much information that I don't know what to do, deal with. Because it's like, yeah, I'm on an alien planet trying to, to kill something, but it's like, you know, what were they doing with the alien? Like, what were they doing? And, like, are we at war with them, or are they just, like, naturally a hostile race, or did we try peacekeeping at what? Like, like what's what's the greater background to half of this, you know? And I, I've never played two. I think I played episode one for, like, five minutes just to see how it works, you know? But I have to say, I love how unforgiving these games like to be. <laughs> like that. Or like with puzzles, there's like no such thing as hints. You have to work it all out in your head. You know, ah, oh, come on. You know. It's like, like back in the big fan chamber, whatever you want to call it. You know, it was like, I was stuck there for good like five minutes. I knew nothing, you know. And you had to like think about it, like why did they give me that? You know. What was the purpose? It was it was cool, you know. I never, you know, I grew up before that era slightly. Like you know, I'm twenty, so like I grew up with like knowing about Half Life and Valve. But like that was like the back end. I was too busy playing like my Thomas, the tank engine stuff, which don't get me wrong, Thomas was pretty dope, and I still think he's pretty dope as more of a more of a joke, you know. Gotta love Thomas the Tank Engine. But, uh, like, it grew up on the back end. So I knew of these games, like Doom and Wolfenstein. You know, they were, like, in the back. Kind of like one of those things where they mentioned, like, oh, you should see this. It's, like, really extreme. You're like, oh, okay. You know? But it was never, like, at the forefront of this is what my friends are playing. It was like, yeah, did you did you play Jack and Dexter or Sly Cooper for, like, the first time? It's like, that game was amazing. Did you see those graphics? And it's like, oh, my God. And, like, I was stuck with the Game Boy for a majority of that, like, initial elementary school. I had a Game Boy and a PlayStation 2. And those were handed down from my uncle, who, who's an awesome man. Like, I don't talk to him much, but, like, props out to that guy. That guy basically started me gaming. Because, like, we got Game Boys, and then he gave us his PlayStation 1, because he got a PlayStation 2 when it first came out. And then, like, right before I think the 3 came out, like, he helped, like, my parents decide to get us a PlayStation 2. Like, that was cool. That guy's still cool. Uh, I don't want to go up there. Like, I know what's up there, and I know... Is he still there? I think I killed him. I Can I trigger what's up there? I don't think so. Shotgun it is. We're going to save. That's a double shot. Okay. Can we get those things away from me? I don't like those. I don't know what to call it. Like, that's the thing. It's like, there's no there's no name for half of these guys. So I just have to use whatever names I can think of to describe it. We're just going to long jump it. Screw it. I feel like I'm abusing half of this. It's like, oh yeah, I have ten grenades. Time to just fire willy-nilly grenades. You know, but it's like, I don't know, it feels like I have enough, like, I'm never set up for failure in this game, you know. There's always some way to get something done, you know. What's, what's that little guy doing? I feel bad for that one. 
it's like, oh yeah, you wasted all your ammo. Well, we're gonna give you some more ammo. It's like, yeah, but you could have done with like three extra shots that you should have kept. There's ammo. Killed that guy. Oh, long jump. Okay. Ah, shit. Wait for him to fire that off. Take that. We're gonna take the health. Um, guess I gotta climb to the top. Uh, I don't know. I feel the cur the, the the difficulty curve is like near perfect. Near perfect. Like I don't know what you could do to improve it, but it feels like there's like I don't know. It feels like there's there's like one one thing. Like there, like there's something you could do to better, and like I'm not hating on the game. Like that's with almost every game. Like no matter how, you know, perfect you believe there is, there's always something you can do better. Like uh, like let's take my favorite like series, Halo. Love Halo. Gotta gotta love Halo. But uh, like I, I see it as like imperfect. Like there's always stuff you can do better. Like I personally like I'm gonna get shit on for this, but uh, personally like my favorite games were Reach. Like I liked. I liked Reach and I liked 3 the most. You know, I liked 1. I had the nostalgic feeling of 1 still. Um, but, like, I, I loved Reach. I thought it was that perfect thing of a new formula plus an old. You know? And it was that blend that, you know, it worked. There was, it wasn't perfect, but there was, like, I don't... There was just... It was near perfect, you know? The competitive scene was good. It wasn't as great as, you know, 3's. Stay over there. But like, uh, like it was just on that track, to, you know, being basically three with new ideas, like that, that near perfect game, you know. So I personally loved Reach compared to like a lot of other people in like a Halo in the Halo community who will probably like be like, nah, 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 three, three, three is probably the best. Which you know, I'll agree, I'll agree, I'll, I'll merge and say three was the best. I feel like Reach was close. And like reach and like combat evolved was like pretty close. They're like they're good tie for second. And the reason for that, okay, where does this take me? And like they, I don't know, they just they just stood out so much. Let's see, where am I going? Down there. So like I don't know. That's that's my kind of thoughts on Half Life currently. Is like. It's not a perfect game. You know, there's no such thing in my mind as a perfect game. But Half-Life is one of the closest things, you know, I feel like you can get to perfect. It's like, yeah, it has its flaws, but, like, at the, of the time this was made, it was amazing. You know, thinking about it, you know, the Nihilith? Hmm. Okay. Oh. Um, Okay. What do I do? Guess I shoot it. Okay. Like, like this is cool. Like, I... Come on, there we go. Like, like that right there is amazing. It's like, oh, you're in the middle... I think this is the final... I, I will say this is the final boss. I know about that. But it's like, oh yeah, this is the final boss. You're probably going to need these. And it's like, we're just going to give it to you. Because what's the point of, like, you know... What, what's How do you say it? What's the point of punishing you when you didn't even know what you needed? You know? It's like telling someone, yeah, we're going to go somewhere today, and it's like, you're actually going camping, and they didn't even prepare, like, they didn't even know what they were going to do. Which I feel like, you know, is kind of what, what makes this game nice, and it helps with the curve. It's like, yeah, you're going to be low on ammo half the time. Have fun figuring that out. It's like, we're not, it's not there to punish you, it's there to, you know, go, shoot, like, I don't know. Ah, come on. See, and it's like, 
things like this. It's like there's no time limit. Any game today would have a time limit. It's just nope. It's just working with different physics. Oh, I I missed that one, of course. Um. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like you know I could write like an essay on this paper, or on this, or a paper slash essay on this game. You know, it just. It feels like one of those games where it's like you can see where it's coming from and what it wants to be. And it's nice, you know. I'm gonna F6 six this. Whew. Uh, where do I jump next? Oh, there it is. Full health, whoops. Uh, no, we gotta. We're gonna load that then. Quick load. Okay, it's just gonna keep respawning more. That's fine then. Uh, ah, come on. Load game. Okay, it, it saves quick saves. Like, I'd love to play Oddworld. Like that's I think that's on my list too, but I'd rather you know have a list of games I haven't played yet. But uh, I don't know. I I, I want to compare this to Oddworld just because Oddworld is like very very unforgiving, and that's a 1990 game or 99 game. Like like those quick saves are pretty unforgiving. So like that's why I might actually like just save twice in a row. Because their quick saves are an actual quick save. It's meant to be a one and done quick save. You know, it's like, oh, you quick saved. Awesome. You mess up at that point, quick save is erased. So it's, spl it's like, cheese odd world. Oh. Okay, load again. Is there another place to jump? Like, I don't think so. So I think I gotta... Okay. Load again. Like, and that's the thing. I, I, I don't know. I feel like doing it live like this is pretty fun. Just because I don't... It we don't see a lot of the people who like play games fail a lot to me like that's it's one thing a lot of people try to edit out is a lot of the fails well, what did I just okay F6 again I think I'm full on rocket ammo of course I see load we're gonna do this load that instead Quick save again. Awesome. Hey, what up, babyface? What if? What happens if I shoot that? Nothing. Okay. Oh, I can shoot those. That's cool. Okay, I gotta land in that pool. Or not. Let's see. Okay.
Okay, I have no idea what I'm doing now. I'm just gonna assume he's a bullet sponge. Ain't that nice. Jeez. Oh, look, did that fill everything? Awesome. I mean, it didn't fill it, but it gave me ammo. Okay, there we go. Awesome. Let's refill. Do I have to get on top of this? Okay. I think I do, okay. Interesting. What's hurting me? Oh. It's plunging me up. Okay. Mr. McBaby face. You know, I've thought about, you know, having some stupid projects. You know, where it's like you just play, like, really just dumb games. Okay, so I can do that. That's nice. Awesome. Of course. Of course. Ah ha ha, I knew it. Okay. I want it. So I think I need to go war it. Okay. Great. Oh, of course they do. Okay. Nailed it. Oh, of course he would. Oh, come on.
Okay, so that's it for this area. Awesome. What? Oh, power. Okay. Life and power. What to do? Oh man, I feel like these need to go slightly faster. I mean, I understand it's enough to not like abuse, but it's like I don't want to sit here for five minutes. Like, there's nothing to commentate about this. Though, speaking of commentating, like, I have to admit the idle animations are pretty nice. <laughs> You know, just seeing him, like, look at the gun at least. It's, it's something special, you know? You don't even see that really much in modern-day shooters. I'll pull out these guys. Like, that, 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 that's something you won't see. Uh, so there's one there and one there. I'm going to assume that one goes to the one up above. It does. Way up high in that really pulley sky. Whoop. Looks like I gotta hit that again. Okay. There we go. I think I should quick save while in this puddle, I guess. Anyways. Yeah, so like there's games I have down there. I think I think the ones in the description I'm gonna just keep as like games I haven't either finished or played yet. Just because like GTA 3 and San Andreas, like I've played them. I just really I think I got to like halfway through the second island. Like it wasn't even that far in. So it's like I'd like to be able to finish those games. Or just something. I don't know. Don't know at all. F6, that's a save. Jump down here. Awesome. F6 again. There we go. Awesome. Hey, more rockets. We're back. Oh, 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 come on. Oh, I'm out. Nope. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> He'll take nine mil. That that'll be fine. Can we get it? Yes. I don't know what I'm doing now.
No one likes you, come on. Oh, I'm supposed to hit him. I'm supposed to go the other way. Okay. Oh, ho, ho, that hurt. Okay. So I need to activate this one. Which actually gets me to that one, I think. Oh, you got me. Damn it. Die now? No, thank you. <laughs> Whoops. So it's up here. I think there's rockets. Yeah, there's rockets. <sighs> Great. Guess I'll heal up again. Do I really want to kill that? I don't know, man. I don't know. Okay, so I think I got this fight underhand. Let's reload. I got no rockets. I have this. I have that. Grenades? Maybe satchel charge. <laughs> he seems harmless. And I hate using that word like he seems hard. It's like great. It's like it's like it's mostly what is it? It's like it's like nearly deadly. It's like can't you just say deadly? Like, you're not going to hurt my feelings by saying nearly. Or by saying deadly. Like, like chill. Come on. Okay. Yeah, but I love the cursor helping for that one. Like, just, just small stuff like that. Like, there's just certain jumps, I, I swear, like, it just helps. Oh, I should have. Oops. There we go, awesome. not this one. Yes, it is this one I need. Oh, come on. What's up, man? I think I'm just going to leave him be. He hasn't hurt me yet. I think she's just here to look intimidating, to be honest. So I need to hit that. Do I need to stop it then? Do I need to... Do I need to blow those up? Like... Okay, I do. Awesome. Well, I figured it out. I have no idea what that just did, so I'm just going to float over. Awesome. We're going to heal up again, so I think this is how I beat him then. So then I destroy the crystals. After I destroy the crystals, I hurt him. Okay, that, that seems fine, I guess. Okay. 
can't wait to finish this game to be honest. Like, I don't know. I feel like this game is just like long enough. Like, it, it knows how to get its plot, plot, quote unquote, through. Like, it's a rough plot, but it's a good one still. It's like, yeah, you're a scientist that comes into work one day, and then like shit happens, and you know, you somehow are the only one. Not that can fix it, but like you just happen to inherit this mess, and like are one of the apparently like one of the few people like people who aren't in it, you know, can trust. Is that all of them? That's all of them. Can I get it? Oh, I missed. Darn. Uh. Whoa. And that's the thing, like, there's no, like, this boss fight is a perfect example. Like, it's like, it doesn't tell me how to beat the boss. It just beat the boss, you know? There's no instructions, it's figure it out. Which is nice, you know? Let's me use my cranium. Uh, come on, I don't want to see this guy again. Like, he's a good guy and all, but like, jeez. Like, see? See? Like, this is why. Okay. So we're almost done with this guy then. Yeah, he has two left. Or he opened his head and there was like, something. up little guy okay I need the inside one so I need the one over there so I need to let him get down Oh, what's happening? Uh, oh, that's rockets. Okay, I need those then. Come on. Up we go. Up we go. There we go. Oh, he got me. Okay. So I need to make that jump the first time then. So it's straight across. Come on. Just as I was about to quick save, okay. Come on. Nope. Okay. So I picked up all this ammo. And I have no idea what to do with it. Okay. 
Okay, so the problem here is that as soon as I step on that, it ejects me. F6, we're going to move out. Damn it, come on. There we go. You can suck it. Guess I'll get up to this one. Okay. Damn it. So it's backwards then. No, it's an How did I get out of this originally? There we go. As soon as I get on the ground, I gotta save then. Saved. What is this? Nailed it. Oh. Is this it? Did I... Did I do it? Well then. True. So, what? Huh? What? Portal? Guess I go through the portal. Subject, Freeman. Status, hired. Awaiting assignment. That was good. I liked it. Well, well done, Valve. Half-Life. I'm going to keep quiet then for the, for the credits. Thank you all for enjoying. I'll end the, the video after all these. So, until then, this is The Lost Prophet, signing off. See ya later.